We're joined in studio here in Red FM today by the Six Nations Trophy and the Triple Crown in the presence of former Munster and Ireland internationals, Alan Quinlan and John Hayes. You're very welcome. Um, I suppose in the context of having these beautiful pieces of uh, silverware in studio today, John, how are you feeling about Ireland after their opening game? Looking forward to, to France? Um, I think so, yeah. There was a lot of negativity around before last week, before the Welsh game. But I think a draw like was really was a good result at the end of the day because we were well up in the first half. But Wales came back into it and we went a long period of time without scoring. So to finally to come away with a draw, I think it was OK all in all. Now, guys, a big story this week uh, for Irish rugby. Outside of the Irish camp at the moment, but Paul O'Connell's unfortunate retirement from playing because of injury. Alan, it's a disappointing way for him to go out. We all would have loved to see him enjoy a bit of rugby in France. You always reckon you made him look good, though, lifting him in, in, in the line-outs and lifting him in kick-offs and stuff like that. You've always said that to me. Absolutely, that's yeah, true. But, um, no, he was, he was just to play with him. I think you get lucky in your career to get to play with fellas like that, that his name is going to be rem- rem- remembered forever in sport, and it's just nice to have played with someone of that world-class uh, ability that he had.